Hey there, digital explorers and wanderlust warriors. I'm thrilled to take you on a journey through the vibrant world of digital nomadism in Latin America. But before we dive into the bustling streets of Mexico City or the innovative hubs of Medellin, let's talk about what it really means to be a digital nomad. What is a digital nomad? Picture this. I'm sitting in a cozy cafe, sipping on a cafe con leche, with my laptop open and the world at my fingertips. That's the life of a digital nomad. We are location independent professionals who've traded cubicles for cafes and commutes for adventure. The rise of remote work has been a game changer for us. Companies are embracing flexibility and technology is making it easier than ever to work from anywhere. As a digital nomad myself, I can tell you there's nothing quite like the thrill of combining work and travel. It's not just a job, it's a lifestyle that allows us to explore new cultures while still pursuing our careers. So the question is, why Latin America for digital nomads? Well, let me tell you, this region is a hidden gem for digital nomads like us. First off, it's incredibly affordable. Your dollar, euro, or pound can stretch much further here compared to traditional nomad hotspots like Bali or Chiang Mai. But it's not just about the money. Latin America offers a rich tapestry of cultures that's simply intoxicating. From the ancient Mayan ruins to the pulsating rhythms of salsa music, there's always something new to discover. And let's not forget about the food. Arepas, ceviche, tacos. Your taste buds will be craving for more. What's more, many Latin American cities are rapidly improving their digital infrastructure. High-speed internet is becoming the norm, and co-working spaces are popping up like cafecitos on a Sunday morning. So what are the challenges that digital nomads face? Now, I'll be honest with you. The digital nomad life isn't all Instagram-worthy sunsets and perfect flat whites. There are challenges we face when choosing the right city to call our temporary home. There are cost of living considerations. So, one of the biggest factors we need to consider is the cost of living. It's a delicate balance. We want to maximize our income while minimizing our expenses. This means finding affordable accommodations, whether it's a cozy Airbnb or a local apartment rental. We also need to think about daily expenses like food and transportation. And here's a pro tip. Keep an eye on those exchange rates that can significantly impact your budget for better or worse. Next, consider internet connectivity and co-working spaces. So let's talk about the lifeblood of our work, internet connectivity. As digital nomads, a reliable internet connection isn't just nice to have, it's absolutely essential. We need to be able to jump on video calls, upload large files, and stay connected with our clients or teams without a hitch. That's why the availability of quality co-working spaces is so crucial. These aren't just places to work, they're hubs of creativity and networking. And on days when we need a change of scenery, we look for cafes and public spaces with dependable Wi-Fi. Trust me, there's nothing worse than losing your connection right before an important deadline. Now let's talk about community and support networks. We need to consider the community. As exciting as the nomad life can be, it can also get lonely at times. That's why thriving expat communities are like gold dust for us digital nomads. They provide a sense of belonging and a network of like-minded individuals who understand our lifestyle. And language barriers can be a real challenge, too. 
While I always encourage learning the local language, it's reassuring to know there are English-speaking locals or fellow nomads around. And let's not forget about networking opportunities and events. They're not just great for making friends, but also for drumming up new business opportunities. So let's discuss the top cities for digital nomads in Latin America. Drum roll, please. It's time to reveal the creme de la creme of digital nomad destinations in Latin America. I've traveled extensively across the region and these cities consistently stand out for their perfect blend of work-friendly infrastructure, vibrant culture, and affordability. First stop, Mexico City, Mexico. This place is a feast for the senses, from the aroma of street tacos wafting through the air to the colorful murals adorning the walls of Coyoacan. What makes Mexico City a digital nomad's dream is its robust digital infrastructure. High-speed internet is readily available and you'll find co-working spaces on almost every corner in neighborhoods like Roma and Condesa. The cost of living here is surprisingly affordable for a major capital city. You can rent a stylish apartment, eat out regularly, and still have money left over for weekend trips to nearby pueblos. Magicos, magical town. And don't even get me started on the food scene. From humble taco stands to world-renowned restaurants like Puyol, your taste buds will never be bored in Mexico City. Next up, Medellin, Colombia. Medellin is considered the city of eternal spring. Medellin has undergone an incredible transformation in recent years and has become a magnet for digital nomads. One of the biggest draws? The weather. With year-round spring-like temperatures, you can say goodbye to seasonal blues and hello to outdoor living. Whether you're into hiking in the nearby Andes Mountains or sipping coffee in a street-side cafe, Medellin's climate is perfect for an active lifestyle. Medellin is also making waves in the tech world. It's home to a growing startup ecosystem, earning it the nickname Silicon Valley of Latin America. As a digital nomad, You'll find plenty of networking opportunities and potential collaborations here. Our third destination, Buenos Aires, Argentina. Last but certainly not least, we have the Paris of South America, Buenos Aires. This city oozes European charm with its wide boulevards, Art Nouveau architecture, and cafe culture. Now, I'll let you in on a little secret. Thanks to Argentina's unique economic situation, Buenos Aires is incredibly affordable for digital nomads earning in foreign currencies. Your money can go a long way here, allowing you to enjoy a high quality of life without breaking the bank. The social scene in Buenos Aires is unparalleled. From tango classes to literary cafes, there's always something happening. And if you're a night owl like me, you'll love the vibrant nightlife, perfect for networking or unwinding after a long day of work. Key features of top digital nomad cities. What makes these cities stand out from the crowd? Let's break it down. Digital infrastructure. All three of these cities boast excellent digital infrastructure. High-speed internet is widely available and 5G networks are expanding rapidly. You'll find plenty of co-working spaces, each with its own unique vibe and community. Moreover, these cities are home to thriving tech scenes and innovation centers. This means you're not just working in isolation, you're part of a larger ecosystem of digital professionals and entrepreneurs. 
And then you have quality of life. What really sets these Latin American cities apart is the quality of life they offer. The work-life balance here is second to none. You can wrap up your workday and still have time to take a salsa class, explore a museum, or simply enjoy a leisurely dinner with friends. Healthcare is another important consideration. These cities offer quality medical care at a fraction of the cost you might find in the U.S. or Europe. And while safety is always a concern when traveling, I found these cities to be generally safe, especially in the areas popular with expats and digital nomads. But perhaps the most enriching aspect is the opportunity for cultural immersion. Living in these cities allows you to improve your Spanish or Portuguese in some parts of Latin America, make local friends, and gain a deep appreciation for the rich cultures of the region. Cost Effectiveness When it comes to bang for your buck, these Latin American cities are hard to beat. Compared to digital nomad hotspots in Europe or Asia, your money can go much further here. This means you can potentially save money while enjoying a higher standard of living. It's worth noting that many countries in Latin America are becoming increasingly welcoming to digital nomads. Some are even introducing special visas for remote workers. Always make sure to check the latest visa regulations and tax implications for your specific situation. Conclusion as we wrap up our journey through the best cities for digital nomads in Latin America, I hope you're feeling as excited as I am about the possibilities this region offers. From the cultural richness of Mexico City to the innovative spirit of Medellin and the European flair of Buenos Aires, Latin America truly has something for every type of digital nomad. These cities offer more than just a place to work. They provide an opportunity to enhance your work-life balance, immerse yourself in new cultures, and potentially even save money while doing so. As someone who's experienced the digital nomad lifestyle in various parts of the world, I can confidently say that Latin America holds a special place in my heart. Future Outlook Looking ahead, I see the digital nomad scene in Latin America only getting better. More cities are recognizing the value that remote workers bring to their economies and are actively working to attract more digital nomads. Countries like Costa Rica and Panama are emerging as potential new hotspots, offering a mix of beautiful landscapes and improving digital infrastructure. We're also seeing ongoing improvements and support for remote workers across the region. From better visa options to more specialized co-working spaces, Latin American countries are rolling out the welcome mat for digital nomads. Now I want to hear from you. What are your thoughts on relocating to one of these fabulous destinations for remote work? Have you experienced life as a digital nomad in Latin America? Do you have a favorite city that didn't make our list? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. I always love discovering new potential nomad destinations. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I'll be bringing you more content on remote work, travel tips, and the best destinations for digital nomads. Stay tuned for our upcoming series where we'll dive deeper into each of these cities, providing specific tips on how to thrive as a digital nomad in Latin America. And don't forget to hit that like button. And if you like this video, you will love our videos on The Top 15 Expat Paradises with Stunning Beachfront Living, Your Ultimate Guide, and 12 cheap and underrated countries for safe living on a budget. Top choices revealed. Until next time, hasta luego and happy nomading.